Oh, damn. So, <laughs> so Sha, you work with um, Dizzy Rascal, right? Yeah, me and Av, we both just work with him. We're about oh, to go. okay. We actually going to work with him again in about a week. Oh shit! Um, okay, we got probably like three records in with him at this point. That's know? dope, man. He's big in the UK over over yeah, over the pond. Right? In Europe in general, like he's really big, yeah, man. Now I heard of him a couple times over here, but like I remember you telling me he's just like massive over there, right? Yeah, he's the OG. He's like the Jay Z of the UK, you know. That's what you want. Get really, that, he get headline. That. He headlines all the main festivals that go on out there. Get that know, UK yeah. money, that UK pussy. That's that's what you want, bro. <laughs> you're you're you get you want. to go out there. His last record, his last record he put out is like with him and Calvin Harris. Like, oh shit, he got a joint. Oh, Calvin shit. Harris it just came out a couple months ago. Yeah. Oh, I'm sleeping. Wow. Yeah, it's like I'm on snooze. And shout out to him, man. He's wild, humble too. Me and Av be like, yo, like we'll work with him. It'll be mad regular good vibes and we come back here and work with some bullshit ass artists and it'll be at It's crazy, right? It's you, like, yo, who the fuck like I can yo, it's crazy. Like someone that's like kinda popping on SoundCloud walking around that plays like Jay Z or some shit. It's crazy. It really blows my mind. Like I would not fuck with rappers if I didn't rap. Yeah. Like I always say, like, this is the whack wackest industry. Like, unless if, if I didn't make if I didn't love the music, I'd be like, yo, you guys are fucking hurt. Yeah, what it's weird. I'm gonna yeah. tell you what I dislike from my experience being in the industry. I dislike when I meet someone and you know, some time may go by. Well, it's a gift and a curse. I have a good memory, so I never forget a face. So I know when yeah. I met anyone. But I hate when I meet people and I know like we knew each they other. They act like they don't know. And I see you again, and it's like, okay, when I met Swiss, I met I met Jay Z when we did the we did I did the song for his tour called You're Welcome, right? Yeah. Um, did that? That was 2008. Blah blah blah. Two years later, I see him at Swiss's birthday party the same night Kanye. Did all that shit on stage with a Beyonce and with the Alvarez. VMA thing. Yeah, oh, with that same Taylor night, Swift. same yeah. night at the Radio City. Whatever. He came. Jay came to Swiss birthday party. He came, went through the crowd, went through the crowd, came to me. So I'm just thinking it's protocol. He's like, "What's up?" So I'm just like, "Yo, man, honored to see you, bro." I'm, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just keeping it genuine. He's like, "What's up?" I'm like. How you been, man? <laughs> like, whoa, so I guess I got I kind of got spoiled once that happened for me. Any of these other dudes, it's just like... That's when you got into the Illuminati. Whoa. Yeah. You know? <laughs> like, what? what's going on with y'all? Because, you know, I've heard that Jay will see you one place and not know you from, from just from interviews and other people that experienced him. They say, you know, oh, he's funny. And I didn't get that. So... Being that he showed that respect, it was just like, damn, I can't, any artist, and I'm talking like, no no artist that's signed done that. It's usually like, dudes I met, like like a hype man or something like that. Just like, <laughs> right. like, bro, like, I'm just a show love dude, period, man. I treat the janitor with the same respect as the CEO. That's an Einstein quote. That's one of my favorite quotes of all time. I live He's like, by treat that. the president the same way you treat the man that picks up your trash. Mm-hmm, 100%, bro. I, I live by that, man, and I ain't gonna lie. Sometimes the janitors be, give more disrespect than the CEO. In my yeah. experience, wow, you know, yeah. and it's just like that's why I wanted to speak on it because it's just like, you know, like I understand it's a crowded game, and you know everybody want to rap, but it's just like, yo, man, energy is everything right now. Hell yeah, and it's just like because it's so crowded. Obviously, we're not looking at the talent. People are looking at you as a person right now. So you know, just just for all the inspiring rappers that's watching or. Artists, producers, painters, whatever you are, just keep that energy in check, man, because yeah. you never know. Like, you never know who could, you know what I'm saying? Any one of us in here could be the next president. Yeah. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, nobody knows what's going on. You don't <laughs> you know, know what's going to happen tomorrow. Exactly. 100%. You and we may not even be tomorrow. here. Real talk. Like, you yeah. know, so that's, a, that, that's one thing that kind of bothered me in this business. But, like, at the same time, not to digress so much, as Shaw would say, like, you know, like I just want to speak on that. My fault, you know. Nah, nah. Yo, <laughs> this, is the, this is the avenue where you can say whatever the fuck it's the you avenue like for say. avenue. Yeah. All right, all right, I like that. Yeah, yeah. The avenue for avenue. That yeah. might got to be a segment. Yeah. It might got to be back you every week. You can say whatever yeah. you want, man. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Word, yeah, bro. Man. But that's 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 crazy, man. Because you have like. Literally, like, live shit that is literally dreams. Like, you know what I mean? So just standing in the same room with you, having you on the podcast, just lets us know. It's like, yo, dude, you don't, 
we literally one degree of separation yeah. away. You know what I mean? So, you know, just you you don't even understand your presence is an inspiration. So by that, thank you again for coming on this yeah, show. Yeah, respect, man. And well, it's shy too, man. Yo. Definitely. hundred percent. What I can say is you, Brother Kenny. <laughs> the preacher. The day I met you, <laughs> I told Sha, I'm like, yo, he's a rapper? Wow. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, the yeah. coolest rapper I ever met. Yeah. Period. I'm, I will not lie to y'all. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I was like, he really rapped for Who's real the coolest real? rapper you ever met besides Jay Z? Besides you and Jay Z? Yeah. Um, <laughs> you. I said, Are you my baby's daddy? She said, Are you my baby's daddy? She said, Are you my baby's daddy? Uh, I swear I did it for the torture. I never had no Range Rover. I used to hit it on the sofa and put that pussy in a coma.